Oh my god. This is insane. Hey everybody, today we're gonna to be cutting Galaxy Stone on my lapidary saw. It's so beautiful. Check this out. So Galaxy Stone is the nickname for amygdaloidal basalt and rhyolite. Basalt is this bluish gray rock. That's the host rock. Rhyolite is this kind of burnt orange brownish stuff. And on the inside of it, where it gets this nickname, Galaxy Stone, it's these pockets of quartz. There's agate in it. It's the agate host rock. It holds so many beautiful, <laughs> you can see the bands right there. So many beautiful details when it's cut. And we've cut some in the past and it just looks like space. And that's where the nickname Galaxy Stone has come from. I have so much of this stuff that we're gonna cut today. So excited to dive into it. If we get some great details of this, I'm gonna be doing a macro slideshow at the end to take some cool pictures of what we find. But before we get cutting, I gotta sharpen my blade on my saw. So this basically just sharpens the blade. Cleans it a bit. Be ready to go. The first two that I'm gonna cut are these bad boys right here. We got some amygdaloidal basalt, amygdaloidal rhyolite. You can see the vug pockets in this one. And then obviously all the beautiful crystals. I'm really excited to see what the inside of this stuff looks like. So yeah, let's do it. First cuts, first cuts are done. So excited. I can't tell you how long I have been wanting to break this stuff open and cut it. You can see right there, looks like some light banding. A couple of these little pockets, that is so cool. Oh yeah, look at that. I egg it right there. <laughs> oh yes. Oh, that is so cool. Yep, we're gonna be doing a slideshow, some macro pictures, the beautiful details we find in this stuff. Off to a good start. Oh, it's so exciting. Looks cool. You just never know what you're gonna find inside them. Looks like some light banding right here. That detail looks kind of cool there. One of my uh, bucket list finds with Galaxy Stone is to cut it open and get like a pocket like that where there's agate bands and it's just huge. That'd be really cool. We got a couple pieces here that I'm excited to cut like this one right here. That actually has agate bands there. It's got a nodule here and then a nodule right here. So we're gonna have fun with that one. We'll cut that one up next. Haven't looked at this one yet. Oh, that is pretty. That's really cool. A lot of quartz. That is really cool. Look at the bugs. That'll look cool dried up. We'll get some good pictures of that. All right, let's see what else. A really great start. So yeah, let's do this little one. I don't have a ton of hope for this. This might be calcite, but this one, ever since I found it, I was pretty excited. I found it up on the North Shore in a river. I'll put the video link right here of finding that. I want a big chunk of jasper too. All right, yeah, let's cut this one open. This is a premium, high quality piece of galaxy stone. Man, nothing crazy. All right, we'll move on to this guy right here. We caught the nodule. 
<laughs> That's so cool. Oh, look at that pocket right there. That is neat. Right there, too. Nice white banding. All right, we'll keep, uh, keep slapping this guy. <laughs> That's cool. Oh yeah. Alright, so showed you guys this end. Showed you guys this side. Look at the bands right there, right there, coming in there, right there. That's not all the way through, that's just a little nodule that we cut. Check this out. So this is a side that has that agate right there. It's got this little vug. We caught the end of that. Look at that right there. We caught the, look at how far that goes in. See that? Goes into right there. Really cool banding with quartz. Almost looks like there's some water level banding. We'll get a good picture of that at the end. Gosh, it's such a thin piece. Be careful with that stuff. Up next, a couple of uh, basalt pieces. I found this one right here. It's got what I believe is either amethyst or fluorite. I found this in Canal Park, right on the beach. Some quartz right there. So we're going to cut that right in half. Maybe we'll see if there's some purple on the side. And then this really cool host rock. It's got these agate streaks in it. So, not too hopeful with this one, being that it's only here. But, we'll, uh, we'll see. I'm probably going to cut it the long way to expose the most surface area. We'll see, though. Vesicular basalt, for the most part. Empty pockets. That's a bummer. Yeah, it is what it is. All right, we'll cut this one with the purple. We'll see what's going on inside there. Ah, no. <laughs> There's not even anything going on in this. Maybe a little bit here. So our kind of crummy piles right here, stuff that didn't really end up anything that kind of wowed me. And this is the good stuff. We need to add more to this pile. <laughs> Let's cut a couple of these smaller ones that look promising. This one is pretty cool. It's got agate right there, agate banding right there. That is awesome. So yeah, we'll cut this one a couple times and then these two we'll just cut straight in half. This one. I showed a nice little short video of that on my Instagram. If you guys want to check out my Instagram, link's in the description box. You can see Igabans right there. It's kind of scattered throughout. I'm really excited to cut this one. I bet this one's really pretty. Let's do that one first. Lots going on there. Right here, right here, up here. That is so pretty. <laughs> awesome. All right, we'll just keep cutting. So again, we got this piece. Some really beautiful details in there. Got some bands up here, down there. <laughs> that is pretty cool. We'll add that to the good pile. This piece I haven't even looked at yet, so let's check that out. Well, that's cool. Definitely some seam agate going on there. Some agate bands in there. <laughs> that's cool. Well, that's cool 
this little guy I don't think there is anything going on that looks purple right there just saying but look at that I caught that little nodule some like little bands not a whole lot else going on in there it's really pretty though really pretty de details going on in there and then I haven't really looked at this either doesn't seem like a whole lot a little bit right there that's cool We'll put in a good pile for once you're gonna take a picture of that. A lot of that that I just cut was looks like rhyolite. So let's grab some basalt to cut. Look like basalt, basalt. This one looks really good. It's got agabands right there. This is gonna be a good one. I'm pretty sure of it. Definitely want to cut that big one. Yeah, let's cut these three. Oh, 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 oh my god. This is insane. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> you guys are going to love this. You're going to love it. That piece is nuts. Let's check these out first. Pretty cool innards going on. Really pretty. Kind of light. Still really cool. Haven't taken a ton of time to look at this one kind of unique nothing crazy that's cool right there by my thumb but check this out <sighs> oh my gosh all right so <laughs> all right we'll do the first one here look at the agate banding in that right there right there I agate banding in a couple of the spots how beautiful are you ready for this this is about as beautiful as the two sons of tatooine <laughs> oh my gosh that's the bucket lister i'm talking about oh my gosh and it goes through to right here look at that oh my gosh <laughs> oh man that is fantastic Oh my goodness. Right there too. Oh wow. But this. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy I got to show you guys this in the moment. Oh, this is awesome. Best one so far. <laughs> crazy. Just crazy. All right, we'll keep cutting here. Well, I know you guys are curious. I went through that. It only took me about, I'd say three, four parsecs to get through that. But haven't looked at any of these. So we're gonna do it together here. 
Oh, it looks like a little bit. A little bit of egg banding. That's pretty cool. Just kind of grabbing it randomly here. And it doesn't seem like there's a whole lot there. A little bit of quartz, a little quartz bug right there. I thought this one might be kind of more vesicular. Looks like there's a little bit, not a whole lot going on. That's probably like feldspar in those pockets by the looks of it. This one, I didn't think there'd be anything because I didn't see anything visible, maybe a little bit. Nothing, nothing going on. And if any of these bigger ones that I'm cutting have stuff, we'll go back make some more slabs not a whole lot in that one either that one only had like a little nodule up here it's like some light banding yeah i thought this one was going to be just like this is very speckled not a whole lot in that one oh yeah some little nodules in there that is cool. Those are pretty. That'll be a cool picture of that group right there. Awesome. Let's do this guy. I was excited about this one. Had this kind of pocket right there. Just excited to see what's going on inside there. Let me get that wet. That's interesting. That's agony right there for sure. Oh, that's cool. Really cool. Get this one wet too. It's kind of drying out. I was excited about this one because it had huge quartz pocket right here. Let's do it like this. That is unique. Definitely got some stuff going on there. Cool little quartz pocket right there. Awesome. All right, well, I'm gonna get a little bit of this cleaned up and we'll see what else we got to cut. All right, we got all it cleaned off and I'd say probably gonna get about time for one or two more cuts. I'm not crazy about that one. That one looks a little light. You know what? We'll save these. We'll save these two big ones. This one, I've been excited to cut for a long time. We'll slab this one and then we'll head inside and take a peek at some of the best ones that we cut today. Check that pocket out right there. That is cool. Let's cut that up quick. And then we'll head inside. And just so you guys know, I'll be cutting more of this stuff in the future. Make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss it. All of our other lapidary videos, cutting videos, polishing, rock hounding. We have a lot of fun. Alrighty, so I'm going to get all this stuff cleaned up. We'll head inside. If you guys can do me a huge favor before we head in, leave a thumbs up on this video if you like it so far. I'm having an absolute blast cutting up this Galaxy Stone. I hope you guys are too. Alrighty, got them. So let's grab these. I saw I got a package from a fellow YouTuber, Geode Cracker and Collector. If you guys haven't checked him out, you should go check him out and subscribe. His channel is in the description box below. But let's check these out. They're so cool. Alrighty, so the last one I cut, I kind of peeked at it, but I didn't look too close just because it was getting a little dark out, so it was a little hard to tell. Let's look together. It's a little light, but there are nodules scattered throughout, so that's cool. It's a nice little group. That's neat. That's really pretty. I like that one right there. That's cool. Oh yeah, right there, right there. Looks like we got some banding. Really excited to take some pictures of this stuff. Show you guys that. That'll be cool. Nice close look at all this stuff. It'll be fun. I think hands down, my favorite ones is this guy right here. And I had some pretty cool details in there. Right down there, really cool pocket. Kind of scattered throughout in this one. That's really pretty. That is neat. Right there, right there, right there. Sweet. You can see why we nicknamed it Galaxy Stone. It just looks like space. It's just absolutely magnificent. So yeah, this is my favorite one. This one was a, uh, what I call a bucket list. 
Galaxy Stone for me. It's got I A right there. I A right there. That's a continuation of right there. And check this out. This is so cool. <laughs> oh, yeah, right there. Like I said, I want to find one with a big old agate in there. How cool is that? Oh, that is sweet. Quartz. See the funnel? That is cool. Really cool. And then the last little slabs of this one. Oh, that's cool. I like that. That, that. Ah, oh, so beautiful. So cool. But anyways, since we took a peek at that last one that we cut and a couple of my favorites from today, now it's time for the macro slideshow where we get to look at a lot of these beautiful details up close. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun. If you like today's video, check the one that's gonna pop up on the screen as always. May the force be with you.